Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. It's Terrell here again. We're back with Arena Log Week 3, calling this one the Diamond Wall, uh, simply because it's really hard to get into Challenger. You've got to hit the top 500 in order to get there, in order to get more than 175 uh, Dimension Gems per week. Let me show you the changes to my team since then. Uh, Elfie is now level 60. Uh, I'm using Sophia now. Since I, they gave us her Grimoire for free, which give, lets her give cooldown reduction to the highest attack unit on the team. And Rito actually has max skills on his S1. Still waiting on Mana Stones for the S2. We're working on his weapon. In fact, let's go ahead and fortify that a little bit while we're at it. Sure, throw that all in there. Perfect. All right, F level 57 weapon, max S1. We've got the Grimoire. I actually had to pull this out of the gear gotcha in order to do it, but you know what? It's absolutely worth it. That damage reduction is amazing for keeping you alive. And plus, it's almost, you know, another 40% attack to all of your attacks. And, well, 40% of uh, 8,000. Yeah, another 3,200 damage to all of my attacks. Yes, please. Absolutely. And if we can get the, the buff from Elfie on there, it's just even better than that. Okay. So basically, we don't have a single target burst anymore, so we're just going to rely on all the AoE pressure uh, from Rito, and then we'll use Sophia to reduce Rito's cooldowns, is essially how this is going to go. We still have Cicero, still waiting to get a SSR tank ready, but uh, let's go ahead and do these five matches. The first one here, I wonder if it's going to be a bit of a weird one. Hopefully not. Let's see if it gives us the 1,000 rank person again. Oh, yep, yeah, there it is. Okay, so we can probably beat this with just a single skill. So basically, we just push a button. Yay, we win. 88,000 to two targets. I guess that's okay, but I have to figure those characters have no gear whatsoever. All right, so quick 30 points. This next one should be significantly better. All right, y'all, uh, there's gonna be a gap in here because uh, I had my parents call with a problem, so we're gonna skip one game and we're just gonna add another one to the end here. What do we got here? The Necroid support, Esta. Okay, so this is an Ash Esta composition. I've got water DPS, so uh, this is gonna be pretty easy. The only thing I gotta worry about is if Rito's gonna get hit by the by the attack down. Well, I suppose I could change my formation to make sure, but not, of course, the attack buff misses Rito. I've really got to get that last copy of LP. Because uh, that would have been a team wipe. Okay, so then we'll want to heal after that. Down to Necroid, so this is game over. All right. Let us keep going. We'll burn off the rest of our tickets here. Uh, Esta, oh, another rit, another fire team. Oh, actually, what am I doing? We want to do this, and this, and this. So this is our standard opening. We're going to the skill two from Aroha to put the damage dealt debuff on them. We'll go into the attack buff from Elfie, and then let's. We're gonna see what happens here. If Ash lands the attack debuff on Rito, we're going to remove it with. Nope, we're not gonna do it. And this should be a wipe on the back line. Oh, that was a full team wipe. <laughs> okay, well, yeah. Rito's, uh, Rito's pretty good when he's max skilled. So, there's that. Uh, 
Okay, this is an Angelo Ash team. Okay. So this should force a heal. It does. Which means I can attack buff freely. The nice thing about forcing the heal there is it's going to waste the cooldown reduction. And of course, Rito uh, gets missed with the attack buff. So this won't do nearly as much as we thought. The Ash should be dead. Yeah, the front line's gone. And I think that's game. He should have healed there, but I don't think he could have. I expected Sophia to go down. That's the problem with using Sophia, because Angela's pretty popular. Oh, God. Oh, no. I could lose right here. If I live here, I win. Okay, yep, that's it. We got it. Oh. Woo. That was scary for a second there. I thought I'd lost. If that Angela was fully built, I would have lost there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was close. All right, one more here. But yeah, the moral of the story with all this is that these max skills are... Ooh, Sungwook... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, this is bad. This is bad. How am I going to kill this Sung Wukong? I don't know if I can. My Aroha's going to be silenced, if not dead. Okay, so the highest attack is the Angelo. It's good to know. Okay, tanks, tanks down. Tanks back up. So we'll be able to hit again instantly. Might be able to kill the Angelo here. If we don't kill the Angelo with this, this is only a rank three skill, so. Oh, of course, Damien dying. Uh, he's got the grimoire on that. Um, I don't know if we win this. I'm pretty sure we're gonna have some serious problems. Okay, we need to recover from this quickly. I think the Sophia's dead. No, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Good, 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 good. Oh, no, no, no. Get the heal off. Get the heal off. Get the heal off. Oh. Okay, good. Let's get a defense buff up. Oh, nice crits there. Oh, gosh. No, 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 no. Cicero who came up. So the heal brought the skill two back up, which is good. Uh, of course, it was the heal. Oh, my gosh. I don't expect to kill anything here. Oh, the Sophia's down. Okay. If we survive this nuke, we win. Okay, that's gonna be game. Yeah, the Angela's down, and so this skill one from Rito will finish it. So yeah. Max skills. Really, really important. Make sure you're crafting your 10 mana stones every week. Just so you can get your skills leveled as quick as possible. Well, that was the arena log for week three. Hopefully we'll uh, get over the diamond wall uh, for next week, uh, for week four, and that'll also be our second episode of the Whales Log. So thanks for watching, and we'll do this again next time.